they buy it the how much is one to, and they buy it sako sako mm-hmm. per sack and they they sell it in tundo sometimes they go to tundo most of the people came from tundo So far, we we attain one million pesos gross sales monthly. One million from the sale of uh, donations. We started with four million uh, three years ago. Then eight million last year. Twelve million. Now our target's eighteen million, just from donations. To be honest with you, our rich bill is not about healthcare. Our rich bill is big business. That is the the reason behind that, no? the lobbying of these multinational pharmaceutical companies. No? Looks like, uh, no. is this your color? <laughs> Basically, we are against uh, the use of uh, contraception and pills. Not because of uh, religious reasons, because of health reasons. The people behind this also is the, the, the rich and the powerful uh, uh, capitalists no? supported by Western countries who would like to to change the culture of third world countries following their culture. No? The church wants to address the root of the problem, no? not the symptoms of the problem, no? but the root of the problem. The root of poverty is lack of opportunity, period. And there should be no politicking as far as issue of poverty is concerned. Everybody should help, yeah. you know, give a share in order to lower down the poverty in this country. Yeah. And perhaps in the administration of President Pinoy, we can attain much reduction of poverty to less than 10%. So far it's around 30%. As high as uh, in Mindanao, it's 80% poor. If you can bring it down even half, then in the Pinoy administration, then it would be a lot uh, I have to be honest and admit that we have neglected, the church also is at fault, no? that we don't have that uh, extensive program of educating the people. Perhaps this is a wake-up call, this RH bill issue is a wake-up call for the church to be aware of her responsibility to educate no? her, uh, her faithfuls in the context of uh, responsible parenthood. We have to provide uh, opportunity for the poor. The poor are not lazy. The problem with the poor is they don't have the opportunity for education, for livelihood, for health. No? That is what we have to provide. And that is where the government must uh, respond. The economy is doing fine, but the problem is where, where, will, where does it go? Uh, who's uh, benefiting more? Is it uh, equally distributed? Is there an equitable distribution of the resources? That is the key problem. But really wealth distribution. Then wealth distribution is the key. The church is the conscience of the state. No? The role of the church is to, to, we call it critical collaboration. The church, the relationship of church and state is what we call critical collaboration. The best partner of the state for the common good of all will always be the church because it has no political agenda. The church has no profit motive, no? The only concern of the church is the common good, the integral development, spiritual and material, of every human being.